morning everybody happy friday so today i have a special treat for myself i'm sorry i just woke up literally just woke up i just threw on the shirt came to y'all i've been working hard you guys know i've been grinding out there well you guys may not know but i've been grinding okay you know god has really blessed me and i'm not trying to be super religious on here but i'm not gonna hide my faith god has genuinely blessed me to be in a really good space financially and to be able to take care of things i'm gonna treat myself to a car today right now i drive a hybrid and i love my hybrid i got my hybrid used a few years ago um five years ago to be exact i want to buy me a brand new car i just want to go ahead and just trade it in for a new car yeah i'm not a very expensive chick i'm very very simple i'm not materialistic i'm not any of that stuff so all right so you guys can see me a little bit better here i wanted to go with a lexus but the only reason why I wanted to go with Lexus is because of the style of the car that they had that I really wanted. And for the, the life of me, I can't think of the car, uh, what car it was. But um, I found out recently that Lexus is actually a, su a sister company to Toyota. So a lot of you guys would be like, a Toyota? Everyone has Toyotas. But I'm not that type of chick. Like I'm not materialistic. I'm not one of those girls who need to have like a seventy, eighty thousand dollar car, a Benz, a Beamer, just to show off to the world, a Tesla. Like I don't need that type of stuff to show off to the world. Like, and those people that have those cars, I'm sure they've worked really hard for them, and it's nothing wrong with having nice things. But for me, I don't need the world to be like, ooh, and I, my stuff. It's it's only for me. Like I said, God has really blessed me, and He knows where my heart is, and He knows that my faith is in Him just last week i actually wanted to buy a, a different car it was just a brand new thought actually no i was talking to my mom and she was saying go ahead and get a new car but i'm like what if i do a trade-in because that's what i really want i want a newer car so the next following week i went to go look at the lexus dealership which is actually what day was that saturday actually yeah almost a week ago i went to toyota and i found the car that i want it's the same exact car that lexus has it's just a toyota Toyota version of it and it is the price tag is a lot less like I said I don't need expensive things I have expensive things but it doesn't make me feel good to have it doesn't make me feel less important to have less expensive things okay it is 6 47 a.m. The, dealer, the dealership opens at 9 a.m. I just called the dealership uh, the finance department and um, You'll be there very very soon yeah so this is actually gonna be my first brand new car first like brand new off the lot car and i'm pretty excited about it so i'm about to go ahead and um water my plant this is my philodendron birkin i already cleaned out the car so that's done so i have a couple of things i have to get done this morning i have a couple of meetings that i need to attend after i buy my car and then lastly i have i have emails to answer i'll be back y'all all right guys so i just threw on some clothes really quick just grab some leggings and this black top my hair's in a bun I don't do anything special. I'm just gonna go pick up a damn car. It ain't that big of a deal. So we're hoping everything goes well. Um, the dealership opens in roughly 10, uh, seven minutes, excuse me. Weird request, I must have my sanitizer in the car as well as my air freshener. So take that with me. Um, other than that, it's time to go. And um, I'll see you when we get to the dealership. Y'all, it's this lady in here, a Karen, super upset that she does, has to wear a mask. Okay guys, just got to the gym. It is 8.06 in the morning and today is day two that I've had my car. Unfortunately today, if you guys can tell by the window, it is raining right now or sprinkling, drizzling, however you want to call it great right like i just got a new car and now it's raining so now i have to give a first car wash i got what i wanted in the car and the only thing that i really really cared about which may not be the most important things to care about is i had to have 
my, my moonroof like that's a must in any car that I have I've only had one car that didn't have a moonroof and I absolutely hated it <laughs> I hated the fact that it didn't have a moonroof I love the car just not the fact that it didn't have a moonroof um, that was a plus for me and then also I've always 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 wanted red and teary this wasn't the dream car that i wanted to have red interior in but it's a car that i wanted to have with red interior it just feels good to be able to um get what i needed the reason why i ended up getting a new car was because my my other car was a 2012 uh hybrid and the car was great love the car I absolutely had no problems with it i was the third owner of that car and in five years that i've had the car i've only had to get oil changes change the tires every year because i wanted to change the tires every year and then um got one tune-up in five years never had the brakes change never had anything other any other major work done to the car so the car ran very well the downside to the reason why i had to go ahead and get a different car was because that car in a hybrid their battery is a bit different for a hybrid battery they're very expensive especially if they're brand new and they can cost upwards of three to five thousand dollars just for a hybrid battery i told myself that if i were to go ahead and keep the car and then go ahead and you know buy that three thousand to five thousand dollar battery do i really want to keep that 2012 car most likely not the car started to show me signs of the battery getting lower and lower so that already told me okay i've had the car for five years i'm a third owner the car is nine years old the battery is finally starting to show signs like okay we're halfway i'm like i'll just go ahead and invest in something else although it is not a hybrid I, the hybrid i wasn't really getting a lot of mileage with it anyway because i drive so fast <laughs> so it really was pointless for me to even have a hybrid so everything worked out uh the gas is really good on this car regardless of the fact um it's a sports car but i'm not really i'm not really big on sports cars but i have a sports car now all right guys so this is what we're working with this is my new car guys it is a toyota camry xle a red interior in here look how sexy that is y'all i will have a screen here i have a panoramic roof which is two uh windows same for the back red interior all decked out sorry guys i'm trying to get this done as soon as i can because it's sprinkling right now this is my trunk i already got my waters and everything for the gym don't mind that <laughs> and yeah guys this is what it is i'm going to get it tinted the two front windows because i can't do that it's just too much light coming into my car but look at the wheels y'all these are super super dope so i'm super excited guys two-tone with the black fin. So that's a small little tour of my car. It, again, it's sprinkling right now, so I didn't want to have too much going on, but super excited, guys. I love my car. I just love this panoramic view. I just love that so much. Like that's just so dope with the red. Guys, I love my car. I'm gonna head into the gym right now because it is 8.15 or 8.16 in the morning and I have to get going. I have a very busy day. So that's what we're doing. Make sure you guys go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And also make sure you turn on your post notifications so that you'll be notified every single time I upload a video because I have more videos coming soon, a lot more exciting things coming soon. And I can't wait to take you guys with me. So I'll see y'all later. I gotta go get in these games.